Hey, what is up, guys? And welcome back to another episode of Visions of Mana. We are, uh, we, we're, we're at the Elm Wind area. I don't know what this place is called. Uh, but yeah, we, uh, we have quite a few things to do. We might start off doing a couple of side quests just to see what they're like. And then we'll jump back into the main story. Man, I want to do the side quest to see, like, if we get, like, experience and all that from it. So we're just going to jump in and uh, see what it's like me can i bother you for a second i wrote this really important letter but i suddenly uh, a sudden gale blew it right out of my hands i was sorry to spring this on you so suddenly i don't mean to startle you thing is i was supposed to send this love uh this letter to a girl i like over in rata a love letter i guess you could call it kind of corny i know now how do i explain this you know how the moonlit par parish parish and the earth village were destroyed well whenever i hear news like that it reminds me that peace rests on a knife's a knife edge a letter like that might be my best chance but just as i was getting ready to go give it uh, give her the envelope a wind picked up and well you know the rest i go look for it myself but airy passage is rife with monsters It'd be way too dangerous for someone like me to go there alone. But you look like capable of, uh, you look like capable Avenger. Do you think you could try and find my letter? I mean, we can try. Uh, some side quests will display hint zones indicating general areas that need investigating. These hint zones will appear on your map. Blue circles. Ah, well, that's easy enough. Uh, items required to complete quests may sometimes be lying some uh, somewhere on the ground. These items will glow a bright red color. Pick them up and bring them. Okay. We do get some stuff for it. Is well, wait. That's like that's impressions. Huh. This is what we're doing. All right. I guess we never picked up a, like a main quest. Uh, we can do some side quests. We get some experience. Wait, did you actually check? Does it give us experience? I think it does, right? This seems to give us a lot of money. I guess we'll do the side quest and we'll see if it gives if it gives me some experience. Cool. If it doesn't, well. No, games tend to change. Sometimes side quests give you experience and others don't. Especially if they don't, then I mean, give or take like, the items it gives you because they're really worth doing side quests. When push comes to shove, I don't hold back. I mean, I mainly just want experience, honestly. Let's take these out. I see it. Get it. We have damage on us. It would be cool if there's like a that system or something. We can give like stats like attack or health. Something like that. Or if it's like visions of mana and when we get to a certain point we can get like an upgrade, which could be a thing, because I think if I remember correctly. Because it's been a while since I played Visions of Mana. I think it was like once you get to a certain level, you had to go and talk to someone and they gave you the, uh, thing -o. It was like something like that, I remember. Get it. Have a baby jump. There we go. I don't know why I can't double jump in towns, but I can in ever else. Done. Whoa, you actually found it. The envelope's still sealed. It's a bit grubby, but at least no one's opened it. With the world the way it is, it's impossible to predict how life is going to turn out. That's why I need to deliver this letter right away. Uh, thanks a lot for your help. Your actions may well... One step closer to becoming a true it gives me guard. money. Eh. I mean, it's not the worst thing to do, honestly. Now we can do a couple. How many are there? 34. All right, we can do them quickly. They don't seem like they take too long. If it's anything, it's probably going to be like either like fight a monster or do something. Mushroom fingers are packed with flavor, you know, that I've ever eaten one myself, mind you. I've always wondered what they taste like. 
Wait, I can be on multiple at a time. That might be the way to go, so I can just knock out multiple quests at once and just hand them all in at once. Um, yes, fine breeze today. Spirits of wind must be in a good mood. I think today might be the day. Oh, hello there. I, I, I favor to ask you if you have spare. My name's Oroshi. I'm a windmill maker here in the Vale. Although I'm getting uh, getting on in my years now, I'm actually thinking of letting my two apprentices take over from me soon. They're both cable windmill makers. My plan was to wait until the winds are fair and give them both tasks to perform uh, unsupervised. And with winds as good as they uh, as we're having today, it seems like now is the right time. And look at the dog. And windmill components. Here's what I need your help with. I'd like you to deliver some windmill parts to my apprentices. When you do, be sure to tell them they need to replace the parts by themselves. They should be willing, uh, waiting for me at Avery Passage. Ah, oh, see, so we're going that way anyway by the windmill. I imagine. The first mill is straight ahead after you leave Long Run. That's the name of this place, right? Uh, head left, and then you find second. You know, I'm starting to think a gracious breeze carried you here today. A fair winds blow forever in your favor, thanks. And there's one more. Well, they're all in the same area, which helps out a lot. We, should, we can knock out all the quests at once. Instead of doing one at a time. Excuse me, are you familiar with the work of Dani, the painter? He's a traveling landscape artist who paints pictures of, a, of the world's most beautiful scenery. Some have gone as far as to label him a genius. For reasons I wanted to go into, I'm on a journey to retrace his steps. I want to see what he saw when he painted. I want to understand what was going through his mind at the time. Hey, you wouldn't be a traveler yourself, would you? Perhaps you've been to a place like Pitcher? Maybe? Fairly sure it's in Avery Passage, but I'm honestly not too sure way of the land here. Uh, if you happen to go find the spot in the painting, please let me know. I'll be right over. Oh goodness, listen to me asking you all these favors without even introducing myself. Where's my manners? My name is Fiona. Pleased to meet your acquaintance, traveler. Well, they're all in the same area. I think that's the last of the quest, right? Yeah, all right, well, let's see what they give us. What is the limit to... Gives me clovers, okay. Healing light. Arrow rain? I don't know what that is, but that sounds kind of cool, I ain't gonna lie. Alright, let's go and do them, and then we'll go back onto the main story. Might as well do these along the way. Look, it, it, it is unfortunate it doesn't give us experience, but more items. Maybe we can get lucky and... Get, look, kitty. Uh, maybe we might get lucky and get some armor or anything. The moment just seems like stuff I can sell. And maybe an ability? I, I'm curious what this uh, rain arrow is. It sounds like an ability. If it is, I'll, I'll put it on. Oh. One. I guess this means I've improved. One bonus. All right. Well, here's the first quest. It's over here. A little pond. Oops, out here. Uh, sorry, can't chat right now. We're getting ready to make some important repairs to this windmill. Send well back if I were you. There you go. What? Oroshi wants me to carry out the repairs on my own? I knew this day would come, but I'm not sure I'm ready. If I make a mistake... No, I mustn't think like that. Not if I ever want to succeed as a windmill maker on, uh, in my own right. Thanks thanks for the pass. I know exactly what to do. Well, there's one person down. Where everything is? Nope. It was not. It was a windmill. We're after we're after the we're after the painting. Fun thing we need to do. Uh, let's go to this windmill first, because this will finish off one of the quests, and then we can focus on the other ones. Let's go on this one first, because it's the one I, I I know where it is. 
mainly because it's the one that shows up on the map. Hey. Get him. Direct. And so in second. I mean, Cringe isn't the most fastest thing in the world, is it? Oh, sorry. Try to attack you. Hmm. Yes, I'm Roshi's apprentice. Can I help you? Roshi's not coming, you say? Does he expect me to replace these parts on my uh, by myself? He wants us to take part, uh, take over for, uh, for, for, let me read that. He wants us to take over from him? I wasn't expecting this to happen so soon. But if Roshi, Roshi thinks I'm ready, I guess I'm ready. I'll repay the faith he's shown in me. One quest done. This one. Wait. I don't even know. Where we going? I'm gonna follow me. Oh, wait. You send me back to the town. I think you are. You're not actually gonna help me with anything that's actually remotely. Give me a bird. Got me with that? Yeah, get down on the ground. Winner. I'm looking for like clips with the tree. Huh. Could be anywhere. Nope. Go and check up here. Definitely somewhere where we've been. I guess. Go so a hint. Waterfalls. It's over there somewhere. Wait, is that the only set of waterfalls? It is. What is this? That's oh, one of the stronger dudes. Oh my lord. Oh, they're level 50. <laughs> ah. Right. They're level 50. And now we know what happens when I die. This is why you save every time. Wait, where was my last save though? Like, where was the auto save? Really? Back here? All right, let's quickly speed run this. Well, that's unfortunate. Well, now we know what happens when we die. So, we've got that going for us, at least. Alright. Hey, let me speak to him. Stand it in. <laughs> that, uh... Well, look, I should pay attention to the levels. Now I know that every level seems... Well, at least we know the waterfalls are that way. We're gonna run straight over there if I can. If I can. If I can't, then I'm not gonna worry. Wait, is that an area that I have unlocked? Oh, it's, not, it's a different area. Go and check it out. Go and... I think there's anything, anything else around. You know, these ones are easy. Fortunately, there was no auto save between these. It's all the big thing. I'm so I can fight it. Yeah, no, I couldn't. <laughs> I got one shot. About 600 I got hit by. Like 668 or something like that. Literally like five times my health, almost. Ah, well anyway, let, let's test it. Let's go this way. We're already over this way anyway, so... I don't know if it's still blocked for me. Yeah, we can actually go in here. Alright, let's go and check. Definitely a new area. Take it this. Has to be... Alright, so I think it's over here. I think that's the tree. I see this chest over there. Mole bear? These don't look like bears. Get him. A little tanky though. I won. Yeah, I did. Mole bear, I didn't know. 
All right, well, let's grab this first. And let's save. So if something does happen again, I don't get shafted. I think that's the tree. We need like a view back. Definitely, the, is there anything tree with a waterfall? Like a little bit. Get out of the way. I'm gonna check it out for a little bit, then we'll go straight back onto the main quest. I just wanted to at least give this a little, little check. check. I think this is where it is. This. Definitely the picture, right? Got the three mushroom fingers. Oh, well, we almost done that. And one. Yeah, but he's like on one of these ledges. Hmm. Do a little gander. See what we can find. There's this chest. This is kind of exciting. A rare item. Mine. Oh, wait, there's waterfall here too. Um. A few waterfalls. It's definitely one of these areas. It's an area of the waterfall. I still think it's that one over there, like just matching them up. Let's take up on that ledge somewhere. Oh no, I thought it was ice. I'm gonna jump up there. I don't know what's that way, but it doesn't look like it can be trusted. A chest in a weird spot. Nope. There's a cliff below me or something. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not sure how to get to this. Got some syrup. Grizzly. It's definitely there. See, that's the view. How do I ex how do I finish it though? Is the question here. Yeah, that's pretty sure that is the view. It is. It's up there. I just have to figure out how to get up there. I think I can swim the waterfall, can I? Huh? Did he get up there? Oh, I see where the... In what world am I getting that chest, by the way? <laughs> Excuse me? Hmm. Yeah, I don't think where's, there's a chance. I don't think that's a dead end there. All right, well, let me try one more thing. Can we get up like somewhere? Nope. Hmm. I want to try and climb up over here. See if we can get up that way. Wait, there is a. Okay, I see. There is a. Uh, there is a ramp up there. I'm gonna go and take it. There'll be a way up there. Where is it? It's over here. There it is. It's on the ramp. All right, let's do this. Then we can head back. Do we kill one more set of uh, mushrooms? And then we can teleport back to the town. Come back. We'll come back later for the chests. I'm sure they'll make us come this way anyway. So we can always come get him. Feel really mean picking on these little dudes. They're kind of adorable. Look at this rain ability. It sounds cool. Where are the mushrooms? We dreamed if some of the mushrooms would come this way too. There they are. It needs three fingers. Come on. I don't know if we get any. When push comes to shove, this? I don't hold back. Did we get him? Mushroom fingers. There we go. I think we did all the. Did that quest too. And all we've got to do is hand in this, and then we can go. 
It is cool exploring the new areas, though, I will say, at least. Something we can do. It is unfortunate we have to backtrack a little bit because. But I'd rather find out now what happens and later. Now we know to be a little bit more careful in the future and don't be a little way too overconfident. I'm just gonna fight everything. Look at that. Taking this? Oh, got up. I don't need to be here, do I? Going this way. This should lead us. Can I climb the vine? I wonder. Well, there's a chest here. Don't mind if I do. Cup of wishes. Can we avoid it? Take that. Still need to figure out what to do with the syrup. Keep getting it, but I don't know what to do with it. And my mage is gonna avoid you all. Like there. There we go. There's the view. You will take. Yes. Doesn't accept it though. Hey, what's this? Don't popped up. Oh, my the view. There we go. I mean, that is a view, though. Look at it. That is down the scene from Donnie's picture. Time to let. Yeah, uh, this is it. The place in Donnie's picture. Isn't the breeze here wonderful? And Mount Gala is even more beautiful than I could have ever imagined. Uh, thank you. I know. Uh, you know what? I think I'll stay here a little while longer. I want to soak in as much as uh, much of what Dani saw as I can. I'm one step closer to becoming a true soul guard. Ah, hello, lady. Did you give me the? I don't know what you gave me. I've already forgot what you gave me. Scenery. Oh, you gave me the clovers. All right. All right. Well, we can. Hey, teleport back. There. Where to next? This helps. Dude, I love the whole teleporting to this. It comes in handy so much. It would literally take us like 10 minutes to run back here. Uh, we can go and save in a second. I was going to end in these quests and then we'll go and uh, continue the main story. I know we really haven't done much of the main story. We're already like halfway through the video, but I want to just test out some of the side quests and just see what we get. Plus, we got to explore some of the other lands, so it's it, it's cool. Right. That's some mushroom finger fungi you have on, uh, have on you. Can I see them? Hmm, they're round and surprisingly firm. Interesting. You don't mind if I take them off your hands now, do you? Yoink. I took my fungus. Thanks, here, take this as a travel. Arrow rain, this is what I want to see. Items. All these, I still don't even know what to do with any of these. Arrow rain. Grant's use of the ability Arrow Rain, when equipped, releases four arrows, dealing slash damage to enemies. Resistant Poison? Yeah, got that. Stamina. The two strength ones, did we not? It's damage. Well, these two. Wait, can I put that on then? Abilities. That's why. Huh. I guess just put it here then. I'll put this on over the crit, it's fine. I still do a lot of damage without it. Well, there we go. And moves. Yeah, let's put it circle. Wait. Can you go over the circle? No, gotta put it there. There we go. You would be I'll take it. Rain ability. Sounds cool. Sure. So you completed my repairs all by themselves, huh? In that case, I think it's time to retire. I always knew they had it in them, but this puts it beyond doubt. Had good wins today, very good wins indeed. Thanks for delivering these parts. Now, I want you to have this. Consider it a day's wage. Healing line. Okay, well, I'm going to do this quest now. I believe that's all the side quests there are. 
no items here we can buy or anything. Oh, let's go and see how this goes. You are here for the wind dying? Oh, forgive me. It is a complicated process. Even oracles in training have trouble with the steps. <laughs> well, someone's got to try. What was it? Uh, breath of fresh air and all that? Oh, look. Ramco has come to Dragon's back. What's a Ramco anyway? She's not a what? She's a sacred beast. Her ilk usually resides in the wind sanctum near the veil. When Karina was training in the sanctum, she suffered a grave injury. Though she lost one of her wings, this sacred beast saw her safely back home. Then the dragon's been following us, by the way. Nigh inseparable. Ramco even began to stay here in the veil instead of returning to her home. Although... Karina has been so preoccupied with Shiryu recently that she and Ramco have become distant. Perhaps they're growing apart. Oh, please excuse my rambling. <laughs> I shouldn't distract you from trying to summon the fairy for everyone in the veil. Yeah, sure. No pressure or anything. You can do it, Val. Let's see. I would suck at this, I'll be honest. I would stuff it up. Shut up, lady. You Please help. Even swat a bug, let alone call forth a fairy. I thought you said you were busy with Shiryu. It's not my fault your flailing was so bad I couldn't ignore it. <laughs> even a novice could do this better than you. Thanks. It's been a while since I laughed so hard. So, you know, push you up know, the cliff. Do you want to give it a go next? Oh, can I? She's the alma fire. Where's the sense in that? True. It's never been done. Please but try to manipulate her into doing it. For the history books, if the alma fire own way. were to call forth the fairy for the veil of wind this year. Give me a break. Oh, I see. Please allow me to try, Shiryu. I bet I can expertly harness this wind. The thing is, she wants to be the elm, right and yet she refuses to do anything to do it. She's just proving the point that she's not the right one. That's all I'm gonna the say. Best dyer in the veil, I have now officially changed my mind. I'll show you how it's really done. Write that in your history books. <laughs> he knew what he was doing. My guy's a sneaky one. He knew what he was doing. See, she's enjoying it. <laughs> Shiri, oh. he had his way. Oh, there's the fairy. It's the fairy. Huh? Can you decline being the elm? Like I ain't sacrificing myself. Get out of here. No. Huh? No, I refuse. I, I won't be the old. <laughs> he declined it. But why? Being named the old is an honor. Why would you run away from your duty? Because I don't want to sacrifice myself. Tina? Um, I actually haven't named anyone the old yet. <laughs> he just ran off. Just looking at him. How could he betray my trust like this? Yeah, Shiryu was the one insisting that you had to call the fairy to keep the veil from being destroyed. Then he just ran away. He should know better. He saw how hard I worked to be worthy. It's always been my dream. Even I mean, were you working hard? Everyone Everyone did it because he tricked you into it. To be the arm of wind. But I can't feel the wind beneath my wings like the rest of them do, now that I've lost one of them. When I told them all that the wind still spoke to me, no one in the Vale believed it. Not the other oracles, not my parents, and certainly not the chief. 
They pitied me. Laughed at me when I said I wouldn't give up. Only Shiryu and Ramco stuck with me. But Shiryu never understood what it meant to me. He never understood me. Well, I'm done with him! Hey, Fairy! What? Appoint me the alms! I'll take Shiryu's place. I'm the perfect candidate. Make me the alm of wind! He's done the very how to do it. The decision isn't entirely up to me. I must consult with your patron elemental first. But your skill with the wind dying was most impressive. The wind was dancing. The element of dragon thing. I believe that Sylphid may accept you as the ohm if we ask. I'll take your compliments to heart, fairy. Sounds like we've got an elemental to convince. Where do we find this Sylphid fella? At Mount Gala, the source of the winds. Do you and your girlfriend want to come? As the soul guard, it's your job to see even potential alms safely to their destination, right? You have a point. Let's go to Mount Gala. I am curious if this game has like a, a main villain in it. We got someone joining my party. find her before we head off or I never forgive myself I ignored her for so long but if this works out and I am named the alm I have to say goodbye before I go and I gotta apologize help me find Ramco uh. where could Ramco have run off to come on Hina let's there we go on this way yeah I, I'm because every game you play there's always like some like main villain in the game so I'm wondering if this game has like a, a main villain. I am wondering if maybe I don't know why he would be. But I am wondering if maybe it's the uh, guy from the stone village, the one who uh, had female turned to stone because just I don't know going off him like they introduced him. We've seen him on the journey, but then he kind of just disappeared. He definitely has some point in this story that he he is a part of. I'm wondering if he's gonna, I don't know, maybe try and interfere with it or something, or trying to stop it. I have things I can put on you. I don't think I have anything for you. I have the weaker thing for you. Oh, so when we unlock it, we can actually change. That was after you. We lose. Magitek goes down by eight. Maybe I won't switch that over then. I'll just leave it what it is. That's fine. Do you have any moves? No. Abilities? Okay, I'll look at that later, I think. I'm getting up here. Um. Oh. I just had to jump up and reach. It was the dragon. Ramco? I'm so. so sorry. I was stupid. I got so caught up in Shiryu that I neglected you. But in the end, you were the only one who understood me. I have to go and meet with Sylphid now in order to become the Alm of Wind. I guess this is... Goodbye. He's kind of adorable Back dragon. Your home in the Sanctum. Farewell, my friend. This isn't the way to the Wind Sanctum, you know. You really? You really want to come with me? I think of a dragon on outside as well. <laughs> yeah, okay. Anyway, if she got to fight with a dragon, that'd be kind of cool. I don't think that's... The spirited and plucky... Kar Karina is skilled in the arts of the spear. Never strayed far from... Katrina's side is from Ramco. 
trusted companion. Ramco will deal uh deal follow-up damage whenever Carlene uh Karina herself. Ooh. Ramco will be uh will get stronger as Car Karina levels up, but her attacks uh are not that powerful. However, she is quite resilient and will not fall in battle no matter how much damage she takes. Wait, that's kind of cool. Wait. If she is kind of attack damage one, then sure, let's Ah, I mean, it's, she gets a lot of defense and a little bit of attack. Let's do it. Makes her a little bit tankier. Go. But we're not done yet. I won't rest until I found Sylvie. Don't worry. I'm here to protect you. I'll take it. Let's go. I'm just glad that you and Ramco made up. <laughs> so now we have three characters, pretty much. And one of them I can't play as. I wonder if I can switch between them. Hey, okay, before we go. I was seeing if there was any side quests or something we can do. Yeah, the squad's getting bigger. Huh? Another duck bear. Yep, duck bears can be found all over the world. At least that's what Shira. Finally, giving these things. You know what? Never mind. <laughs> Let's be sure to greet any dud bears we spot during our travels. We'll probably end up with spare grizzly syrup to trade anyway. Yes. Uh, dud bears are furry creatures who adore grizzly syrup. If you give your grizzly syrup to the dud bears you encounter on your travels, you may be willing, uh, they may be willing to exchange it. Um, precious, hard to obtain items. Give me a. Not you. There's a little rat. There it is, this way. The little mouse, whatever it is. I don't know how much syrup I have. I have 79. The dictionary. It has language. <laughs> Interesting. Chocolate. Oh, I don't care for any of these. Ah, not even a weapon or anything. Depressing. Right, which way am I going? Let me go this way. Oh, give me like a rare item or something like a weapon or. It would be a little bit more useful to me, but as that's not the case, yes. we go then. Karina, the wind conveyed the news. You are off to consult with Sylphid, the elemental of wind, if I am not mistaken. There's nothing you can say that'll change my mind. I'll become Elm and make you see you were wrong about me, about everything. Soul God, as you can see, young Karina is as stubborn as can be. But we cannot disobey the fairy's guidance. Please see Karina safely to wherever she is needed, be that the mana tree or otherwise. You can count on it. Well, you heard him. Just remember that you'll have me to thank for the Vale's prosperity from here on out. Well, I had to point out. Before you leave, Soul God so is literally a Soul God. Paying strength sigil. Paying a stamina sigil. I would have you take oh, this nice. seed with you. It is said to bring. Well, you need like a Soul God for each. Take it with my blessing. Of the alms. Thanks. I'll find a use for it. The alms are necessary to preserve a future for the whole world. It is our duty, much as a soul guard's duty, the to ish. protect us. Garbage world to live in. Karina, <laughs> have to sacrifice herself to, to save it. to take upon herself the task of an alm of her own volition. No one fights against their fate if they themselves choose to bear it. We all have our individual roles to play. Places from which we hail. Ways of life. All of these affect the future. And I am proud to be the bearer of such an important Wait, wasn't mission. that dude that we saw the last episode of the campsite? He was a soul god, was he not? Maybe he might be the main villain. Maybe he's trying to stop this cycle or something. I don't know. It seems weird that we had that little cutscene of him and then we just randomly run into him. Doing something. He's on, he's on some journey. 
at his name though. Let me get a piece of that thing the chief gave you before we left. I figure I need to be as strong as I can be to fight monsters out here. Wait, you're going to fight too? I might seem like a delicate blossom, but I'm a force to be reckoned with. That wasn't the happiest farewell back there. Will you be able to set out on the pilgrimage straight away if you're chosen as the alm? Don't worry, I'm not leaving anything behind that I care about. Honestly, I couldn't wait to leave. Wow. I've always wanted to see what's out there in the world. Back in Longren, they don't let you travel much unless you're chosen to be the alm. If it weren't for you showing up when you did, I'd still be stuck in town itching to get out. Thanks for that, actually. Then I suppose we'll have to do our best so that you get to continue on the alms journey. The people of Pianea sure are friendly. Or maybe you folks are the exception. I feel like our shoes would be so hard to walk in. <laughs> Do that. Mountain looks so much better than ours. This looks peaceful. The one in our village is like about to explode in five seconds. Where are we on the map? Oh, it's all another area. Wait, there's the on the map. It's. I wouldn't say it's big area. I mean, I guess each area has like a lot to explore. I guess. The elemental vessel is reacting to something. How strange. Oh. <gasps> I do believe the spirits wish to aid you on your journey. Thanks. Elemental Coming in two hours, I got a boomerang. Different types of mana and bestow those powers on their wielders. Don't hesitate to use them during your travels. And now I must be off. Oh. Seen an elemental vessel for the first time. You can use. And we got a boomerang. Uh, once you acquire an elemental vessel, you can choose to borrow the power of its elemental by going to the gear skill menu. It change our s oh, it changes up. Equipping a vessel to a character will activate the power of the corresponding class. It's known as a change of class. After using the elemental vessel during combat, it will enter a brief cooldown period before it can be developed, uh, deployed again. Second enemies with normal or special attacks will shorten this period, so plan your strategies accordingly. We unlock the wind class. You are now able to access the vessel menu. From here, you can choose which elemental powers to assign to a character and equip the corresponding... Okay. Vessel. Well, there's a few. We put it on. A wind? The arm looks kind of cool, though. I mean, new weapon as well. That's a two handed weapon. That's one we could have picked up at the shop. Change class for the first time. Uh, new class unlock Rune Knight uh, A character's class is determined by the elemental power that resides within them This is uh, this in turn governs the traits and abilities at disposal Changing classes will alter the character's stats Unlocking abilities unique to that class may also change the weapon they wield in battle uh, Experiment with the different classes uh, classes Available to your character to find the one that best suits your individual playstyle. Do oh my, uh, the elemental plot displays how much of an elemental power uh, powers you can wield. As a character progresses through the plot, and uh, the more in tune they will be with the element, clearing the way to learn powerful moves and abilities. Moves acquire, acquired through the elemental plot will still be available for use even if the character switches classes. That's cool. I think it was like the last one too, if I'm not mistaken. Elemental points are required to advance along the elemental plot. And, uh, you can obtain these points by converting gold clovers found throughout the land into eternal points. Uh, elemental points by gathering... Okay, so that actually helps us out. 
Oh my, the Dilfid boomerang houses the might of Dilfid, the wind elements. It is capable of harnessing the howling winds and whirling gales. Press R R2 to send out a gust of wind that temporarily traps enemies. Attacking an opponent while they are in the state will cause blades of pressurized air to rain down. Wait, that sounds kind of cool. Progression is 10. So I can't... No, so I can't... Okay, I can't take that off them. So whatever. Okay. Oh, I took my armor off, like. Oh, I like the armor thing it gave me last time. Well, Karina? got a big ass sword, though. <laughs> Bigger than I am. I think it's going to be a lot slower to attack with, though, but we'll see. Let's test it out. Very slow attacking. Oh, wins. Any around there? It's cool. I was attacking really slow though. Got some syrup. Got some syrup. Taking this. Oh, I see the chest. The question is, how do I get it? You see the chest? I'm just gonna figure out how to get up there. There's gonna be a way I can like, jump up or something. Hmm. Don't see a way I can get that chest. I can't jump up there. Eh, we'll get it later. I'm going to collect these things along the way. And I'll grab this. Well then, maybe we should go back and see if I can get that other weapon I could buy. It will actually be better. Now we should do this. Uh, uh, gathering... Elementite will restore some mana and also grants you uh, elemental points and interact with them uh, with all element elemental these area on the map. Okay. Do it. Other quest. Find a gather element. Okay. So wait. So if I. Oh. Abilities learned through the elemental plot. Uh. But are unique to the class corresponding to each element you only become active when the class is used these class specific abilities provide a variety of special effects characters tapping into their full potential may take some trial and error try to choose billy seeds best okay press and hold to switch that's what i have on now Use the power of wind to imbue an ally's weapon with wind. Okay, we need five points. Just getting started. Latent power. Unlock the move. Okay, well, I'll unlock everything. Thunder, uh, thunder saber. Use the power of wind to imbue. Okay. Well, cool. Where are my points though? It wasn't used in my uh, thing, guys. We've got this. Raise attack by twenty percent when a weapon is imbued with. Oh, I see. Points. We have some for you too, but we'll worry about when we actually get you. So wait, so we have nothing there, nothing there. Okay, vessel. We can go back to guard if we want to. But our attack goes down, magic goes down, defense goes up, special defense goes up, stamina goes up. This is just great power. Then it just seems like moves. There's the Thunder Saber. Thunder Saber there. And we have abilities. Elemental Blade, raise. Firm. I think that's permanently on then, I guess. I don't know. 
there. There was another chest down there. There's no way I'm jumping off that ledge. Yes. Go. Oh, I'm jumping across here. Yes. That's the ability we got, wait. Now we've got an electric sword. Hey, this is kind of cool, though. Okay. I see. I'll take the electric shield. Uh, oh. Another one. Take it all. More power. I wonder what my, ulti my uh, ultimate Billy looks like now. Oh, we can Beyblade in the sky. Go. You're having an electric sword. Oh. Summon attacks may inflict status effects on your character, in, uh, uh, ending them in battle. Every status effect causes different alignments, uh, ailments, sorry. Be sure to cure your allies as fast as possible. Uh, remember, while status effects prevent you or an ally from performing uh, optimal in combat, cast them on an opponent can help you get the upper hand in battle. Uh, the status effect poison will periodically deal damage to your character while in effect. Then underestimate how dangerous this condition can be. I have an electric sword, that's all that matters. Attack's really slow though, that's the only thing that there's. Well, if there is a build that has dual blades, I'm going it. This was our victory. That's cool, but yeah, it does attack a little slow. Wait, this wins uh there's thing is here too. Am I still poisoned? Yes. Yes so. boomerang will react when you come across something like this i get it we use the power of wind to get past the cliff okay i can do this there's a first time for everything let's give it a try i mean a wind bridge uh, elemental triggers are curious manifestations of elemental powers that when under the influence of an elemental uh, will cause changes to the surrounding landscape or sometimes even the player character to activate a trigger first obtain the elemental vessel the corresponding elements and then interact with it uh, you can hop into the, the updraft generated by the silphid boomerang once you're in press x to jump high in the air press x when your body lights up lights up cause you to jump higher and further okay Say no more. Grant me power. Let's ride it. I still can't believe it. Oh, oh my. Oh, huh. Yep. I felt like we were oh, God. There's something on the. I guess the little <laughs> things on the middle. There was. Probably chest down there. I'm stuck. I will probably go to the next save. Burn right up there. It's this. Uh, the shimmering scale butterfly you may spot spotted around is known as the Vela flies. Interact with the Vela flies will make enemies more ferocious, but will also double the amount of experience you earn by uh, for defeating them. Ah, oh, great! Like I can take anything on. Wait, I want to try this ability. Oh, it does no damage. That's depressing. It <laughs> do damage. Got a boomerang though. Uh, uh, having this. Level up. up. This is kind of exciting. Nice. Hmm. One more gear. One of the That's best true. classes in this. Definitely gonna have to experiment with some things for sure. 
there's something as uh, a chest in here we're going for it I'm move damage okay hey no I'm making the electric sword give me the fire sword easy give my experience uh, the Sil Silford Boomerang can summon air currents powerful enough to pick up large rocks. Carefully jump across them like stepping stone to continue. Okay. That's kind of cool, though. So I don't know how to jump on him. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of cool, though. Right, let's hopefully we'll get to a new uh yes. safe point soon. There's no coming back from a fall like that. Watch your step. Thank God I can double jump. The amount of times I'm gonna miss one of these jumps of Grizzly. Yo. I'm con Whoa. This is why I'm concentrating. My brain just switches up when I'm j oh not oh, really here. Yeah, that actually puts you back quite a bit, doesn't it? At least I don't disappear. Come on. I'm overshooted again. I don't want to have to run back. Go. I'm gonna speed run it. No, I'm gonna fall off again. 100%. Did imagine if made me go back to the last save. I would have to do all this again. Come on, don't fall off now. How do you think Sherry was doing? He was in shock. But I think he'll be okay. Going this way. What do you think, Karina? Me? I'm not even gonna bother thinking about that. Level six? <laughs> yeah, I got an electric sword now, people. Now what? Ah, that's what. It's cool that I can imbue my swords, though. I think I said that I can carry over effects, right? Different classes. Yeah, there's chest over here. There we go. Be digging this. And we keep going. Please give me a save sometime soon. Yes. Oh, home barely made that. I'm gonna fight it. Oh. She heal. I don't remember what she does. Oh, things here I'm gonna take. What is this? Yes. I want to save. I want a save point. If I can't, I might just teleport back to the other area. If I can't find a save here, I really need one. No saves in existence here. Hmm. Got one of these though. I smash. All right, you know what? Go back here. I'll make sure I get back here on the next episode. But this is gonna drag on too long. But yeah, we're gonna leave the episode off here just because I do have to get a couple more recordings done. So uh, I don't wanna go on too much longer. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed this episode. We got our first class change, which is pretty cool. Uh, but yeah, see how it goes tomorrow. We're gonna make our way to the mountain hopefully uh between the episodes maybe i might go back and try and see if i can get some upgrades from the store or that and before i come back here but yeah hope you enjoyed this episode if you're new channel don't forget to subscribe hit that notification bell and know when the videos go live and i'll be back again next time so until then take care and peace out